Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise the higher, everybody. Praise the higher. One more time, praise the higher from whom all blessings flow. Amen, amen. This is your sister Carrie Ann in Messiah the Christ, Messiah the Messiah, Messiah of Nazareth. If you want to know why, I call God a higher. And the biblical Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Messiah. I've done a video concerning that one. Greetings to the 12 scattered tribe of Yashahel. Yashahel is the name given to Jacob. Jacob's name was not changed to Israel. The proper name is Yashahel. So I greet all Hebrew. Yashahelites scattered to the four corners of the earth. Hallelujah. And to the beautiful body of Christ, the church. I greet you all in the matchless name of our soon coming King Isaiah, whom. Uh, we'll be coming back for the church without spot, wrinkle, or blemish. Hallelujah. Okay. You can skip this bit and find the main message, brothers and sisters. Remember, my name is Sister Carrie Ann. It is in solid gray border. Anybody else pretending to be me? There's a wicked, de dirty demon. You need to rebuke and report them. Okay. And remember to watch the video to the end. There's a sinner's prayer there for you. And also the various social media that I'm on. Because on here, I am not safe. And one of the things that this platform does is to buffet my videos. And also the sound. Brothers and sisters take ages. Even though the video has been up for half an hour, 20 minutes. Absolute age for the sound to come in. And from what some of the brothers and sisters are saying, this is the only channel so far that they know of that has that problem. Everybody else's channel, when they upload, they're okay. But with this one, this channel, the enemy is fighting tooth and nail. But we stand firm in Christ. Because the word of the Most High has to go through and we fear no foe. Hallelujah. Glory be to the Most High. All right. These are the top 20, beautiful beloved. Anybody who comment on any video, I give you a little shout out. All right, so these are the top 20, beautiful beloved, on the powerful video that I did concerning um, it's AIDS, but I call it SID, just spin it backwards, so to speak. Um, that this thing is going to change. Very, very powerful video. You need to watch it. These are the top 20, beautiful beloved, on the video. Antoinette, the Stacy and small worship the real father. Yeah, worship the real father. A higher daughter. Hallelujah. Monique Scone. Let's bring it up. Savannah Cotterell. Terrian Walker. Tan Tanisha Barrett. Ricky M. Natasha, okay, Natasha Chambers, Marlisha Coolsbell, Juleth Berry, Sally Grace, she, 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 Sharika Henry, okay, I'm bringing this up, T.D. Andrew, Colleen Heller, Aistro Beats, Leanne King, Gage in His Glory, Paulette Allen, Mula Buder Budder, Ashley Dinger, Lively Stones 777, Shanice Henry, Christy Lee, Voice Crying in the Wilderness, Shanna Fisher, Marcel Lopez, Lichu or Lichi, <laughs> the Holy Watchers Ministry, and Miguel belong to Yesaya Yesuma. All right, so those are the top 20 beautiful beloved. I need the powerful video concerning AIDS. All right, um, okay, so we are near, we're not only, oh, this one. we are near, we're not only near to the returning of the beautiful Messiah, all right, but we're also near to the revealing of the dirty Antichrist and the lawlessness of sin. Brothers and sisters, you need to read Daniel 7, verse 25, talks about the lawlessness. It is coming, Satan will rule this planet for a period of time. And when he's ruling, we call it the new world or the beast system, because in this world, you will not find the Holy Spirit, much less the Savior or the Heavenly Father. They will not be there. And um, and your only choice is going to be either three, three things, really. You're going to have to hide and hide good, all right? Or 
it's either going to be the guillotines or the mark of the beast. Those are going to be your three only choices in that demonic world until the Messiah comes for the for his people. All right, your only escape really to find words to escape all these carnage coming upon the earth is through the second exodus and i've done many many videos about that all right and the second exodus happened before seal six in um in um uh, in revelation is it revelation six i think it's revelation six when seal six is open the second exodus happens before seal six all right so we're very close to this thing to unfold all right we have a prophetic theme song also called We Are Near, song that my mommy taught me when I was a little girl. And it's our prophetic theme song and it goes like this. Round there you are, round there you are, round there you are, round there. Round there you are, round there you are, round there you are, round hallelujah yes we are near and we can sing that song with right confidence brothers and sisters okay awesome heard beep most that all right what date is it today i like to give dates all right so today's the 16th of august so it's i had a very powerful vision and it's been a long time really to be honest with me here is the must say been years since the most i haven't given me visions back to back i had about three visions back to back and this is one of the first one i'm sharing um so in this vision brothers and sisters it was a massive massive may day in babylon uk and this is the reason why i say to brothers and sisters you have to prepare because the bear is either go with the bear country you know drip drip vladi they're either gonna attack Babylon, New York, or Babylon, London. And we were pondering which was coming first, but I don't know. Brothers and sisters, from this vision, I do believe that, I do believe that Babylon, Babylon, UK will be attacked first. From the vision that the Lord has given to me a um, couple days ago, which is the... Um, the 15th the 15th of of august 15th of august 2022 i do believe from this vision that babylon london in in particularly in particularly will be attacked now in this vision it was like a school day because i saw lots and lots of school children running and lots of parents running all over the country to go and pick up their children but what was happening is that something was released in the air and it was poisonous. So all of Babylon, UK, all right, was affected. Some parts of the country, like Babylon, London, was more affected than other parts. But nevertheless, everybody was feeling the pinch of this toxic chemical that they released in the air. And this chemical, brothers and sisters, was coming from a nuke, a silent nuke. Because in the vision, it was made very, very plain to me that the attack was coming from the bear country. The bear country. Now, remember I've done videos or more, a couple of videos where I say that Babylon UK has got absolutely no form of defense in the atmosphere unlike babylon us that can detect threat and probably have half an hour grace or 20 minutes grace i don't know how long uh, to warn the people to say look destruction is coming prepare yourself babylon uk do not have anything like that they did have it they did have it, but they took it down. <laughs> They've taken it down. Now, will they put it back up? Maybe. And if they do put it back, the alarm system or the alert, is it alert? If Babylon UK does put back the alert system in their hair space, in the atmosphere, then something is desperately wrong. They know that there's a threat coming. 
because I, I believe that maybe the reason why they took down this alarm system, this alert system, is because they just believed that Babylon UK was safe. There was no threat because I think they had a system up for World War Two and World War Three and all of that. And all that is done and dusted. They've taken it down, and so they're probably thinking that Babylon UK is safe and nobody will affect, nobody will attack them. But if they begin to put this alarm system back in their airspace or in the atmosphere i don't know where to take it from but anyway if they begin to put up this alert system to warn the people that there's incoming danger then brothers and sisters please wake up because something is desperate or wrong something is brewing and it is going to happen because uh, you know if all of a sudden they're going to do that then obviously they're not going to come out and tell the people what the bear country is planning because that's top-notch intelligence but nevertheless nothing is um hidden in darkness stays in darkness the most i will always reveal to his people in the light and so in this vision brothers and sisters it was absolutely it was chaotic but i know that it was lots of children that was running to and fro so that's the reason why i know this thing is going to happen on a school day so is it threat from the bear country to Babylon UK imminent or Im yeah use the word imminent is it imminent or is it soon I'm gonna say it, it is soon it, it is going to happen nobody expected 9-11 everybody think that Babylon US was the safest country on planet earth oh yes even though it was an inside job surely but anyways nevertheless um but still nobody knew that something like that would happen until it would happen and it was absolutely devastating and this is going to be the same thing and people need to begin to pray when we wander far away from the most style, the covering is removed because you know we see covering from other things except Yesiah and his beautiful father Ahaya hallelujah and so therefore we have to be on the alert brothers and sisters and understand the times and the season that we are in know that we are in the end times things are going to speed up and things are going to get worse not better but though those things are happening around us um, the most style knows how to maneuver his people amen he knows how to maneuver his people uh, to safety for for protection he knows so we don't really have to worry about that but at the same time we need to know of these incoming dangers from the wicked because these people are just right down wicked they love war they love power they love control they love money and this is what all this is stem for and there's a saying that says that the good <laughs> have to suffer for the bad all right um but in the mountain of these things happening, brothers and sisters, please understand and please know um, that Haya will protect his own. Baba says that he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall, what, shall abide underneath the shadow of the Almighty. And you know, Psalms 91 says that, you know, though the arrow fly it by day, what's the arrow that David is talking about? Though the arrow fly it by day, it shall not come near thee. So though the missiles may be flying over your heads and carrying on, it shall not be. It shall not come near you. And also remember one thing as well. This is for Babylon um, UK as well. Those living in Babylon UK, but also it can reference to Babylon US. When you begin to see, and I said this before, I've, I've, I've done the videos. When you begin to see warplanes, more than usual in the sky please understand what time it is when you see them please go get your water go stock up on your stuff and what of you you're gonna have signs and clues to know what's happening because ahaya is warning so you will have begin to have, um you begin to see signs and um a couple of days ago i was by my window and um i didn't have my phone in my hands but i saw two war helicopters one behind the next and i've never seen that before and i was gonna video it but i didn't have my phone in my hand and they just passed over my house 
right right in front of me near over like near to my house really so there's drills going on but the key thing is that listen to me and listen to me very carefully when babylon uk or babylon well babylon us has got stuff in the hair space but when babylon uk comes out and tell warns the people that they are going to have some form of alert business i don't know where they're going to put it out i don't know please understand that this is serious that the threat to babylon uk is it's soon and it is going to happen the vision is true i saw it the poisonous gas and it was it was released from the nuke i beg your pardon brothers and sisters the poisonous gas it was released from the nuke and like i say you know some parts of the country suffered more than others so this is something um this is something that is brewing this is something that is coming I've, I, please watch my food playlist on russia i think i call it russia's prophecy or something like that the bear country's prophecy please watch them and understand because um these warnings will come to an all halt <laughs> if, sorry oh my, what am i eking up like that that was a lie these warnings will will come sorry to an halt very soon but for those of you who are who understand prophecies and know the time and season that we're in and understand the warning from this channel you will be okay you will be fine and there's other watchmen and watchwomen and call them truthers out there who wants and was letting you know that this thing it is going to happen and it is going to come so yeah the vision was um the vision was very short but very very powerful and very informative so school day lots of children running up and down parents panicking to go get their kiddies the atmosphere was filled with poisonous gas from the nuke um and we were told to go in our home and in the vision it was made known i don't know if it's a dirty caesar's or all, but i know that in the vision it was made known that the attack was coming from the bear country 100 percent, it was from them it was not if but or maybe it was from them so i highly never lies he never lies all right all right so i wanted to come and do that powerful powerful vision for you brothers and sisters so that you understand and know what we're dealing with all right because the higher loves you that much you know if the lord didn't love us he wouldn't warn and he's so i don't to me a high is so amazing because we have the bible for those of us who believe in it we have the bible and in the word of the most high is the end time prophecies and you know destruction coming up and the returning of christ and the second exodus and stuff like that but the lord didn't just say here you go there's a bible you read it go understand it still warns though we read it it is still send brothers and sisters to still warn. amazing absolutely amazing absolutely amazing he's so loving that's a loving father though we have the manual in front of us and we have the opportunity to read it it still sends people to warn from the manual to the body of christ amazing just love the lord literally i, I absolutely adore him um because he really loves his people glory be to the most high hallelujah all right if you come to the end of the video you have not accepted Messiah as lord and savior please say the sinner's prayer after me the Messiah, the christ I know that you are the son of a high whom the world calls God. I believe that Yesiah died on the cross for my sins. Yesiah, thank you for dying for me. And I believe in your death, burial, resurrection. And that Ahaya has raised you from the dead. I know with confidence that you are the son of Ahaya. Yesiah, king of glory, I come before you right now. And I'm asking you to wash away all my sins. And forgive me for all that I've done wrong. I repent. For my wicked ways, Ahaya, I thank you for your beautiful son, Yesiah. And I pray that you will help me to live a life of repentance and give up the things 
displeasing to you in this world. Thank you for salvation and for saving me. Hallelujah. If you said that prayer, you believe it. Welcome to the body of Christ. We believe in Acts 2 verse 38. You've done the repenting part. You now need to find a man of the most start higher and ask him to fully baptize you. Dunk you like a submarine in water. We, we believe in the spiritual transformation when you go down in water. You're saying to Yesiah that you believe that Yesiah died on the cross. You believe in the, in the atonement of sin. When the man of the most start raised you out of the water, you're raised into new life. You're raised into the power and resurrection of Christ um, everlasting glory and power amen hallelujah okay so be bold be strong be courageous walk with a higher just like Enoch and have the mindset of Job hallelujah all praises all beautiful praises to the most high higher who lives above the heavens a higher eternally bless you I love you all and I will see you soon someday in glory in Yesiah's holy name amen and amen let's say the benediction benediction is Jude chapter 1 Jude chapter 1 verses 24 to 25 the Bible reads now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise Yesiah our savior be glory and majesty dominion and power both now and ever Amen and amen. Amen. Blessings. Amen.